Devotion inspires bravery. Bravery inspires sacrifice. Sacrifice leads to death. So, feel free to kill yourself. Guardian, my agents report that the Taken are gathering at a Cabal camp near your current position. But we have no idea why. I would appreciate your insight. So what if the Taken are gathering? They're not bothering us. With a little peace and quiet, I might be able to do some real work. The Taken are an army without a commander, Asher. If we leave them with a little peace and quiet, they might crown a new king. We found a scary portal. Reminds me of the ones we saw in the Dreadnought. A portal to the Ascendant Realm. The Taken world lies beyond that veil. A new power must be seeking entrance into our world. You should be able to directly manipulate Io's hyperparticle dimensions to collapse the portal. Sorry, what? Your hands! Use your hands to pick up the energy! We've got it. Now what? Bring it to that portal! You're fighting entropy with order here. Move! I'm pretty sure that's our whole job description. Shadows grow darker in the presence of light. Fight back, Guardian. Hurry. Whatever is on the other side of that veil has to know you're trying to seal it in. Ikora, something's coming through. How deliciously unexpected. Hey, team. The screaming thing from the Abyss is dead. That creature was the servant of some higher power. I fear something has claimed Oryx's crown. Yes, yes, let's move on. Your intuitions were correct, mine were not, and the Guardian's prowess in battle was... adequate. Assistant, I have a task for you. But I fear your fleshy body is... insufficiently resilient for my purposes. Did you just say fleshy? There's a garage nearby, full of armored vehicles. Procure one. Now that you have use of this device, do you recall the Warmind Vault? The Vex are keenly interested in its secrets. That ends now. What kind of information do the Vex want from the Warmind Vault? The Warminds had a special connection to humanity's lost arts. Music, literature, film. The Vex may not understand this emotional frivolity, but they will use it as a weapon against us, if we let them. We're making good progress. Um, I have a suggestion, though. A suggestion? Well, if the Vex stole irreplaceable data, wouldn't it be good to, you know, recover some of it, instead of destroying it? Huh, recover it. Huh, yes. Yes, well, <clears throat> fine, fine, do as you see fit. I don't see anything of interest in our kill data so far, Asher. Are you sure these are the right Vex? What do you mean, the right Vex? You know, like, are these the robots we're looking for? The Vex would not trust goblins and hydras with such valuable data. You need to find the Vex mind responsible for the incursions. You're really infuriating sometimes. All right, one mind coming up. We got him, Asher. Looks like the Vex did steal files from the vault. Let's see, some files about Mars, some of them Anna Bray, and of course, lots of data on the Warmind project. Hmm. You'll have to take a look. I hope it's useful. Hope is a logical fallacy. Only data leads to concrete solutions.
As we all know, Zavala plans to attack the Almighty. Typical Titan idiocy. I'm sure he thought, ah, Gaul has a Sun Destroyer. I don't need a plan. I'll simply headbutt it. It's desperation, Asher. Zavala has forgotten he might die his final death. Head toward the heart of the energy mining operation, Guardian. We'll use a war mine. Part of an interplanetary defense network to scan the Almighty. I think we're close, but so are the Taken. Vex, too. Pay them no heed, Assistant. You and I can deal with them later. We found another drill. This one's big. Really big. Good. That drill pierced an entrance to the war mine vault. The scanner's inside. Gotcha. Let's find the drill controls and get it out of the way. Still in our way. Ha! Ah, what a gloriously irritating commitment to safety standards. There has to be a manual override somewhere in that base. I find it incredible that those myopic Red Legion ignorami did not realize they were drilling directly into a war mind vault. Stranger things happen every day. I'm detecting a spike in paracausal energy. Sterile neutrino particles have quintupled. He means watch out for the Taken. You should hire a translator, Asher. Sounds like it sounds like someone's whispering in there over and over. Yeah.
I'm detecting... I think this is sending a message back to the Ascendant Realm. But who's listening? Find that override. <laughs> I think we've got the drill going. Good. Return to the drill site and get into the Warmind vault. I am eager to discredit Vu Vu Zela's plan to attack the Almighty. Uh, are we going to see Rasputin, or is this some other war mind? There is only one war mind, but Rasputin is not here on Io. I believe he's been marooned on Earth ever since his network fragmented. Whoa, the drill's on. What? Lift it up before it collapses the war mind vault. transformation process sure leaves some weird artifacts behind. If we let them, they'd have this whole place looking like Nessus or Mercury. Finally, let's get down to the vault. on our way into the vault. This will be rich. I will ask Zavala, can you tell me in Zeta Jules the Almighty's expected destructive capacity? And he will say, no, Asher, I cannot, because I am a reckless fool. Ignore Asher. 
Find the war mine. Reconnect it to the network, and we'll handle the rest. Reconnecting to the Warmind network to begin a remote scan. Yes. We can see the connection coming online. Hang on. We've got taken.
scan going. Orly, the Almighty is inextricably bound to the harmonic resonance of the sun's magnetic flux tubes. What? If Savala blows up the Almighty, it'll take the sun with it. It's time I rejoined my fire team. Guardians worthy of the light. What is the price of such power and immortality? Devotion. Self-sacrifice. Death. Death. Explain. Devotion inspires bravery. Bravery inspires sacrifice. Sacrifice leads to death. So, feel free to kill yourself. Devotion. Sacrifice. I was born an outcast. A runt. As is custom with the Cabal, I was cast aside and left for dead. I was taken in by an old scholar himself disgraced who saw in me something redeemable. He raised me, taught me, trained me, and in return, I would become a vehicle for his revenge against an empire that failed him, that failed itself. Rejection, ridicule, torment, it made me stronger. I gave everything to win, not just acceptance, but glory. Beneath my mask, Sticker, is the face of devotion and sacrifice. I will not take the light by force. To do so would be to admit failure, and I never fail. Now, do you see? why I will be chosen. I see now. I see all that you have done. Our operation on the Jovian moon was a success. Once the cage is complete, we will have everything we need to begin the process of extracting the light. Dominus, Everything we've worked for is here, for the taking. All that remains is your word. No, this is not the way, old friend. But it is the way. The only way. Not for me. And a novel experiment assistant, and you shall be my guinea pig. I need you to gather radiation. Move, go, shoot. We're happy to help, but why? What's the experiment? I am trying to create synthetic light. If this experiment succeeds, then perhaps we can make new guardians here. It won't work, Asher. The energy here is not light, and <sighs> science cannot manufacture blessings. So you say, but you have not stopped me, have you? You want this to work, and it will! My theory is sound! These Taken are drinking something from the ground. Who's drinking what? Hurry up and deal with him! Field team to home team. We are 100% irradiated. Excellent. Now we'll need calibrations. Act naturally, assistant. Go punch something. I'm sending that data back now, Asher. 
Um, should we keep punching, or...? No! My field equipment is ready. Go to the test site. If this works, it will change everything. I think we're coming up on your test site, Asher. You simply need to activate the field equipment to begin, and be gentle with it. It's yours to replace if it breaks. Okay, Asher, something's definitely happening. But we've got a lot of Taken coming in. Yes, yes. I expected they would be drawn by the anti-umbral pulses. It's creating some kind of energy. Huh. I'm seeing extreme variance in my data. The Taken must not be allowed to interfere with this experiment. Extravagant light shows can't create guardians. All clear at the test site. Um, do you guys have any results? <laughs> isn't going to put the Traveler out of a job, right? Unfortunately, my predictions appear to be flawed. Your light cannot pass to another, nor can the power created by this experiment. What he means is no. We cannot create or take light. Only the Traveler can choose to gift us with it. Let us know if we can help with anything else. I didn't think it would work either, but... You can't help hoping for a miracle. Huh. How strange. This is Vex technology for sure, but it looks so primitive. They must have mimicked the design from some time in the far past. Assistant, is that you? Vex energy readings are off the charts. Go find out what's happening and be quick about it. Asher, we found Vex protecting some kind of construct. It's pumping energy into the ground. Someone's carved something here. It says, Oh, let time not deceive you. You cannot conquer time. Huh. He read, maybe something from the Cryptarchs. A theory that the Vex are actually that goo in their bellies. The constructs are just exoskeletons that they drive around. Asher, we found a construct injecting something into the ground, but a Vex mind showed up and took it. The mind took it? Yep, just swoop, took it. We're tracking it now. I hypothesize that the Vex are preparing to fully machinoform this moon. <laughs> like you do. Ah, yes, laugh it off. The Vex are simply planning to transform every planet in the system into a cog in a vast, inscrutable machine. They merely wish to convert every particle of matter on this moon, living or dead, into a radiolarian solid. Well, when you put it that way. Asher, we followed the mine to some kind of sink plate. How curious. See if you can establish a connection with the Vex Collective. I've designed a virus which might prove... useful. A virus? Huh. I hope you know what you're doing. Ha! I've established a link into the Collective. I can't deploy the virus. A Vex mind is blocking deeper access. Oh. Probably the one that swooped the construct. We'll find it. According to the Collective, the Mind is summoning some sort of pestilent defense. We destroyed the Mind, Asher. Yes, yes. Now return to solid ground before the Vex reconfigure their thought protocols. Those platforms are about to disappear. I've just lost access to the Collective. Nonetheless, I did manage to release the virus. I imagine the Vex will find this development rather upsetting. <laughs> that doesn't sound ominous. Indeed. We shall allow this experiment to unfold in its own time. Ah, my assistant. I admit, I may have underestimated your ability to gather verifiable data and... Uh, gawking at my arm, are you? Let's get this over with. I entered a Vex construct, the Pyramidian. Inside, I suffered an accident. My arm was transformed. It is consuming me. If I do not find a way to reverse this, I will die. So, now you know I'm afraid. So really what you're saying is, we're damned if we do, damned if we don't. On the contrary. Now that we are together again, we just might stand a chance. The fact is, if we destroy that weapon, we will ignite a chain reaction that could send our son into a supernova. Well, at least we have each other. 
indeed. We all know what needs to be done. The Traveler must be freed. I'm thinking the three of us and a big fat pile of explosives can get the job done. Look, I still have that Vex teleporter. It's got a limited range, so we'll have to get a little too close for comfort. Then we get inside the city walls for it to be effective. But without the light, an outright assault on the wall is doomed to fail. We could... There will be no coming back. It's worth it. How do we get in? You know, the city wall is kind of like this barn. Plenty of places to slip in unseen, so long as you know how. You sure you're not one of my hunters? <laughs> not really into capes. Clearly. Nice poncho. You need to get your team into the city without raising any alarms. My people and I can help you do that. We also happen to be pretty good at shooting bad guys. Hawthorne, it's one thing for us to put our lives on the line, but this doesn't have to be your fight. You're not a... A guardian? You think you've cornered the market on sacrifice? You forget that we've had to survive without the light all our lives. Once upon a time, that big white ball in the sky was there for all of us. I think it's about time we return the favor, guardians or not. That's great speech and all, but let's not forget about the whole supernova and complete annihilation thingy. If we can't destroy the Almighty, we'll have to disable its weapon. And that means getting a certain guardian on board. We'll need a good disguise if we're going to fly right through a Cabal Armada. If it's a Cabal ship you need, there's a base nearby full of them. But it won't be easy sneaking in. Oh, we're done sneaking. If there's one thing I've learned from Cade, it's the value of a grand entrance. This is great. Anyone want a hug? Hugs? No? No hugs. <laughs>